So, bonjour, and welcome to another vlog. We have a continuation of home ski resort. Well, I guess 1.0 is done, but then it rained for like four days. So what used to be like really snowy and nice, it's just grass. But luckily, I made a lot of snow. We still have a pretty solid starting chunk and slope is more or less intact. We got a little bit short on snow right here, but it is now minus one, which is proper borderline. But I'm gonna try to get the gun or the snow gun set up. See if, you know, it makes a little bit of snow. But first, it is snow gun placing time. For which we have the Traxter, we have the winch, we have the snow gun. So I'm gonna try to attempt single-handedly to move the snow gun up here so that it can spray further down. First mission completed. Snow gun in place, ready to shoot down. Looks nice. As you can see, still a ton of snow left. switch there we can hear we see it expanding so we know we got pressure and we are spraying water final step and there we have it now i just gotta make sure to angle that so it falls on the slope and not blows to the side uh, that's how easy it is with a bit of wind not easy at all now all we can do is pray to the weather gods if it gets colder because we have a few things we want to do, but I need more snow, and the forecast just says bad. But at least I have a lot of snow here, which makes it feel better. We'll check in with that thing in a bit. But yeah, let's um, see what you guys think of this vlog. Super happy to see all the positive feedback on the last one. I had a ton of fun filming it, doing everything in it, and just generally what I was doing. So thank you. But now, we're gonna try and see how this works. So you know how I said in the last vlog that it was uh, Home Ski Resort 1.0. 2.0 means that there's upgrades and we had the first one <laughs> coming in just shortly. And that is going to be a proper upgrade, helping us get to 2.0. And what do we have here? <laughs> we have proper light towers. I can't wait to see what this is going to turn out. Light-wise, it's gonna look like or in the VM Arena. We're going from this to that. It's good you guys are helping me get to 2.0. Making sure the light matches the snow gun and the snow machine. This was 1.0, which I thought was not bad. <laughs> this was a rock. And now we have three and a half, four centimeters of snow. Now we are talking. Viking Hill World Cup Arena, light one, light two! <laughs> you want to turn off the light for a sec just to see the difference? And this is... yeah. <laughs> That's a proper upgrade. So here's kind of the not so glamorous part you might not see when it comes to snowmaking. It's 3.30 or 4 a.m. and <clears throat> I'm just out to check on the gun, see if the weather direction has changed, but it's yeah, not that nice to get in the middle now. There it is. Nice with snow. <coughs> <coughs> ah, maybe we'll twist it a little. <laughs> Ch 
should be better. Oh yeah, I'm not, now you know the real story on how to make it snow. You clean up all your mess, you. Well, it's hard to like... I mean, I had a long morning because, you know, I was tough all night. I wake up at seven and it's silent. Electricity for the whole house was blown because it got cold overnight, so he didn't use more electricity and then ah, that didn't work. And then the tubes had frozen, so I had to like fix that and so I spent like an hour and a half. <laughs> um, and now it's warm again. Uh, no spraying now. But since we're in the mood of fixing things, we have a, well, an upgrade for the house while we wait for the cold weather to come back. Because it's always like I got gun going and then snow comes. So I'm sure it's going <laughs> to snow like 20% of the year. Here I can check because I know there's a roof underneath here. Okay. Ah. That's pretty decent. A big area. Yeah. You know, we used the time wisely. I think it's a job for the trackster. Yeah, I think so too. Everything gets stuck by the time now. Let me get the keys. I wonder how many steps a day I take. More. Stop. It is pure More ice. ice. Yeah. You need spike tires. No. Before we take the snow cap. <laughs> What is in here? Heavy. Okay, screen. That's what we call a screen. And this is what we call a real simulator. And we have another one in the basement. What, two of these? Yeah. Two is better than one, right? <laughs> I like that. Although, this one we gotta figure out how to get in the house. The other one we gotta mount. Come look at this here. Okay, that's the real stuff. Yeah, it's for Porsche RSR replica. No problem. I mean, now it feels like home. <laughs> you know, it's kind of clean this morning, kind of organized. And then once you have like a calm moment, that's when you find time to ruin it completely and start something new. And where do you want to put it? We have a bit of work <laughs> in the room they're going to be. Da, 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 da. Oh my god. But the good thing is most boxes are actually uh, the other simulator. Oh yeah, it's true. So we're not looking that bad. Yeah. Just bad. Yeah, we should probably start attacking this to get the... Figure out which ones are sim boxes and which or just my crap. You guys don't see the basement a lot. True, yeah. It's because the basement is really old and nothing to see. <laughs> but I'm looking forward to digging in and making it better. So this is a great first step to see what we can do about this room. I mean, we got a solid uh, mix. We have parties, <laughs> old clothes, old clothes, a new cover for the sofa that we were gonna make. And we're cutting the time lapse because we gotta get some work done. Yep. A lot better. It's kind of nice because when we moved from Cyprus, like we had all the trucks come from Marbella, Monaco, so like a lot of that stuff was all like unpacked boxes. And here we have another thing to assemble. <laughs> like just the weight of this. That's crazy. We're gonna have two of these. How do you feel about our chances of us uh, doing this successfully? From my experience with you. Skeptical. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, but remember, I'm a handyman now. I got this. I just say, like, we're both sucking at reading manuals in general, so instructions are not our strong side. No, at least we have one to look at. <laughs> yeah. cube. this I know what it is. This I also know what it is. Seat. How wide are they? Can we even fit two? And maybe I should have checked that first. <laughs> but we can fit them two like this. Yeah, yeah. I always have these ideas that, like, Awesome, sweet, and then I'm like half with 10% through. <laughs> yeah. Like, I guess I'm not like chilling tonight either. 
Yeah, no, we have a broken TV. What happened to that one? Well, Leon happened. Remember, we had it for like two days. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Why don't you? Well, it's just, it's nice. You're not gonna destroy it. But it's like, isn't it glass fiber in this? Okay, we got These them. are my babies. <laughs> these okay. are my globals. This is not a paid collaboration. I mean, it was before, but I can say again, this is the best. <laughs> <laughs> I'm and never... careful with very few things, but those are one of them. Not cars, not <laughs> anything, but. Nice. Have you ever seen that? <laughs> no, never. <laughs> Now we have one assembled, so we're gonna take that down, see if we can replicate it. All these different parts, they all come from grid engineering. Like this was quite a while ago when I was asking them, like I need a simulator, I need to practice my racing driving. And then they got in contact and they helped me kind of put together because I was kind of lost. I'm like, what do you actually need? Well, like what makes the difference? So then they made sure, you know, having a good pedal box that's solid. Thank you, because I, I, yeah, I think it's hard to figure out what kind of simulator, what the difference is. So all we need to do now is get them together. Step one. Made some solid progress down there, but batteries needs to be refilled. So we ordered some hamburgers and fries from Jets Burger. Very good. But we're gonna have a little bit of a appetizer. An appetizer. It's been a while. We used to have this as a, a tradition in, in Cyprus every mm -hmm. Friday. Every Saturday. Friday. Was Friday or Saturday? Friday. Every Friday. So it's Friday. <laughs> it's Friday today, actually. <laughs> I've, I've had bagu every night this week. <laughs> I'm like a little nervous cooking a Wagyu steak with probably a lot of people that are very good at that stuff. <laughs> but this is what I normally do and it turns out very good. I'm sure that it's wrong. A bit of salt. Bring this. Burgers are here. Yep. Let's see. Mm hmm. Nothing beats that. If you've had Wagyu, it's pointless to eat any other meat. <laughs> yeah. Just like this, by the way. You only eat this straight, like as an appetizer. Yep, Fabian is here. Hello. So you see all the screws here. <laughs> you see all the screws here. And we have put in a million screws. Bags were obviously labeled from the beginning, but like that would be too easy. So we just mixed them up. <laughs> yep. No, we're doing okay, but it's just like you have to flip these in, then find the screws and like line it. And then if you're starting to become a little tired, which I am after last night, you do something wrong for like 20 minutes, you realize, ah, oh, I'm an idiot. So then you do it again, and do it wrong again. I'm not the brightest cat in the room <laughs> at the moment. Oh, I did it wrong again. <laughs> he, he has to replicate this, yeah, by the way. <laughs> like, he has a copy already. No, like, I looked, I'm like, why is it not like, uh, prepared so that it's lower? I'm like, Oh, here it is, but I still screwed in the screw <laughs> for this side. And why I'm wearing a headlamp inside is because when I get tired, I can't see anything. And I went up to change the batteries to maximize the size. Oh, the grand. I feel like a bomb technician. <laughs> I mean, let's take a second and look back to how it looked this afternoon. Da, 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 da. Oh my god. <laughs> That's a big, big difference. Yeah, we're doing pretty good, I would say. And look at these two bars over steering wheels. Yeah, we gotta lift this a bit. 
and you have the two mega screens. Yeah. But what that's gonna turn out uh, like, what else we're gonna we're gonna have to come back with tomorrow. Because um, yeah, this guy here. <laughs> I mean, I did vlog at 3.45 this morning. So yeah, that's fair. We're doing one room at a time, extreme home makeover, <laughs> but just with fun stuff. Yeah. So, sleep, and then uh, we're gonna be back, and you're gonna have to see what this looks like. So, I thought of the idea of making the simulator room black, and then before I started installing, I'm like, nah! And then we installed, and I'm like, it needs to be black. So I probably should have done that before, but better late than never, right? So, so we start the day with uh, painting. <laughs> so I think clearly this whole room needs to be black. But yeah, should have done that yesterday. But that would be being smart and rational and that is one thing. Uh, maybe I am not. I am quite impulsive and if I feel like I need something, I need it and I cannot wait. Calling a painter, no time doing it myself. Well, the more you do, the more you learn. Like your tools. You know, you're, when you're on a time budget with kids incoming, you gotta be efficient. But pretty nice uh, cover job, right? Yeah, yeah, I told you, like, it looks like a pro. I'm, I'm quite, quite happy. But what I've realized is that it's pretty raw concrete. Yeah. So just one surface, it's not like you go like this. Then you have to push and... Oh yeah, I see. It's uh, quite a bit of work. Just to make this clear, this is in no way a DIY-like video of how to do things. <laughs> this is me just trying. Yeah, exactly. So feel free to let me know what we're doing wrong. Uh, probably a million things, but it is getting done. But I think it's gonna be cool. Oh, it's gonna be sick. It's gonna be better than the box room it used to be. But I gotta use up this paint before I take a break, so I'm not wasting it. Okay. Because I think we're low on paint as well, so I can't go heavy on paint. Okay. Okay. Paint away. Paint away. <laughs> oh, yeah! Yeah, this is the time I moved to last time. Yeah. Hello, Leon. We've been at a birthday party. Hello, hello. Nah. Oh. And I'm also happy. What a slope. <laughs> yeah, what a slope, right? I'm like, oh, where should we go in? Here, yeah, I was like, I have to walk around. Oh, you haven't <laughs> been here since. No, only when it was like in the start, I think. Hello. Bye, Bye guys. Enjoy. Bye bye. Bye bye. Enjoy bye. the weather. Hello, Mama. <laughs> hey, do ice cream. Ciao, ciao. Ciao, ciao. So we had to change of plans. We're delaying skiing because uh, Leon said we should absolutely paint. So this is how you get things done while you have little kids around. Leon got the right outfit. Leon got the right outfit this time, all black. I even have shoes. Yeah. Look, he's like killing it. Draw Leon. This is a good idea, said no responsible parent ever. <laughs> So, kids are asleep, but it's day three because we realized we needed some cables and stuff. We were ready to go last night, but then we had to go get cables for three days. And before we enter, let's remember what it looked like three days ago. Da, 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 da. Oh my God. But the good thing is most boxes are actually uh, the other simulator. And now I bring to you the updated, much more fun simulator room. can see the kids did a wonderful job of uh, painting uh, the whole room uh, they actually helped so yeah. it would have been easier to paint before 
but clearing out the room, masking it all, mounting, painting, and then getting everything set up. It was a push. We're not used to PCs, games, and this stuff, so it took us a while. And now you have the Porsche RSR, the Porsche RSR. The RSR steering wheel, very important. Now we just finished setting it up, so we're gonna have to, you know, do some practice before we look good, but at least I figured we had to test it. Yep, I mean, this is a sick game room. Yeah, I mean, comparing it to what, it, like, the waist they used to be, and now we have this. The only problem is that me, when kids are asleep, I'm gonna need to, like, tape a baby monitor here so <laughs> if I see if they wake up, I'm gonna have Leia, like, tap me on the shoulder, like, ah! No, but this is cool. Like, I've always wanted a simulator. Never really got to it, so thank you. Grid engineering, because if it wasn't for you guys, I would not be able to play this. So we have Assetto Corsa and we have iRacing, so that we can try a few different games. And I'm sure there's a lot of people uh, watching that knows a lot more about this than we do. But we're going to get into it and we're going to practice, because I want to work on my Rutskogen skills. And I know these sims are good enough to like actually practice actual race car racing. 100%. Uh, if we look tired, it's because like we keep <laughs> having these like, sweet, yeah, like 24 hours, let's go, no problem. And then like, huh? <laughs> We've been going on the midnight. Yeah, we really uh, tried. <laughs> yeah, but uh, that's reality. So, but now let's let's enjoy the the fruit of the labor <laughs> for a little bit. I mean, it's good to be naive sometimes. I'm very good at being naive. Yeah. <laughs> Do you want this or this? I take this one. I think Fabian is more the right fit to race against you. Like you guys saw me yesterday with the Fiat Punto. <laughs> You're like Monza. You know that? 300 kph straight through the first UK. There's going to be some proper sucking in in the beginning. Okay, this is fun. Normally, whenever I get in a simulator, or like TV game, I can't even make it around a lap. This shows the difference of a real simulator, because here you can actually drive. Oh, knocked up. Oh, something happened. Oh, you crashed? Yeah, he crashed already. Let me know if you need some tips later. <laughs> the simulator is super strong. Yeah, it's a crash. Oh, 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 the curb there was evil. But once we connect everything to multiplayer, yeah. this is going to be highly addictive. <laughs> Lap time deleted! Ah, oh, 1.59, but uh, we, we're gonna be uh, gentle on uh, the rules. <laughs> this is gonna be one of these things where... Uh, my parents used to say, Jun, uh, <laughs> bara when I was a kid. That means, Jun, uh, let me just... <laughs> <laughs> this is me. This is... <laughs> yeah, <laughs> <that's> <laughs> yes, <laughs> yes. I had uh, the sim in, in Marbella when I did the virtual Formula 1 Grand Prix. You know, I've been racing with Albon and uh, oh. Russell and... Ghastly, pretty bad, um, <laughs> but I competed. What did okay. you get? 224. <laughs> no, I saw you on a 206. I, uh, yeah, I restarted one. Yeah, because his car broke down. Yeah, the car broke down, <laughs> so I restarted. <laughs> but you can feel that this you can actually practice in, so I can uh, go into Rutskogen. That's a difficult track. But yeah, um, room, fin well, okay, so not 100% finished. I have these, uh, all these like, sick photos of car stuff that I figured should go on the walls and as part of my therapy uh, when it comes to good enough <laughs> I decided that we can still shoot the vlog even though the paintings are not on the wall please apologize for not being finished oh yeah and we still have <laughs> the paint here <laughs> this room uh, ready to play with I think we might just continue with another room let me know in the comments if you have any suggestions uh, we've been thinking maybe if we can re try to redo the bathroom ourselves what else do we play room play room. Kids, like go completely uh, crazy there because I like the I like learning I'm trying to be a handyman yeah, so we really. went from ski slope to gain room and now the question is what do we have next and uh, when we have 2.0 but we need cold weather for, for the ski yeah it's still no a bit too warm Yep. But now we're going to end the vlog and we're going to sleep a bunch uh, until we figure out what to do next. So make sure to stay tuned and we're going to do something and remember to like and comment because and subscribe because that really affects the algorithm of YouTube. So if you like, like it. <laughs> that's about Simple as that. That's the only brain power I left. So over <laughs> now, we'll see you on the next vlog and we'll see what happens then.